I wanted to start this vlog off with showing you guys the best breakfast place in Toronto. I am just freezing. Damn, it's so cold in Toronto. This is the place. You could literally get like the cheapest breakfast over here and um, it actually doesn't taste so bad as well. Let's check them out. Hi there. Thank you. So this is what I ordered. For three dollars and fifty cents, you get one egg, two bacon's, two toasts, and home fries. But I don't eat bacon, so instead of bacon, I just get another egg. Three dollars and fifty cents. Best place in Toronto, or should it be best place in Toronto or cheapest place in Toronto? Or does it make it the best place in Toronto because it's the cheapest place in Toronto? I think we'll just go with cheapest place in Toronto. I'm pretty sure there's much better um, breakfast places where the food probably tastes better. Thank you. One thing I don't like about using this mic is that I always have to check that it's on. Because if you forget that it's not on, and you start recording, there goes your vlog. Finally here. I can't wait to eat this and uh, I'll be right back after breakfast. All right. For him, you gonna go get some tea? Yeah, dude. Yeah, eat tea for the office. Gonna get some tea. No man, why are you turning around? Why are you so shy for bro? Huh? Well, is it because you don't have your makeup on or something? Yeah, man, I'm not looking good for the camera right now, you know. So this is Noman. I tried to introduce him in my first vlog, but I couldn't introduce him because I forgot to turn the mic on, which I turned on this time, so we are good. So hi everyone, my name is Noman Hussain. Alright, it doesn't have to be so formal, you know. Say Wagwan everyone. The name is Noman, you know. But I had a couple questions for you, if you don't mind. Yeah. Uh, my vlog is about um, young entrepreneurs that are, you know, trying to start a business in Toronto. So, are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. All right. Just need a suit and tie so you can look professional for this interview. Uh, is this nah, nah, I'm joking. What about just uh, like this? Yeah, that's perfect. Actually, there you go. <laughs> that's how blue flower works. <laughs> okay, so for my first question, Noman Hussein is going to be. Um, what single advice do you have for young Toronto entrepreneurs that want to start their business and who are not even done graduating from college or high school or yeah. high school probably, but not college? So, yeah, I mean, I would say, uh, Toronto is a great city, of course, to start any businesses. There are uh, a lot of different places you can go for uh, funding opportunities for employment subsidies. So. If you're starting off in Toronto, this is about as good as any city gets to start a business. So that's like a good thing that you should keep in mind. Um, but yeah, as far as starting a business, I'd say the best advice there is, is to just think about how you're going to add value to other people's lives. Because if you can't add value, then you can commercialize on it, you know? So as soon as you add value, people uh, pay for things that are valuable. And uh, that's pretty much it, how to make your clients super happy and uh, just uh, keep going. So Noman got some good advice on the fly. I, he didn't even rehearse this or anything. So that's <laughs> I didn't memorize that. No, that's that's how you that's how you know he's good at this stuff. Ask you one more question, all right? 
cool, cool. Are you ready? It's a curveball question. Yeah, yeah. Um, okay, so, well, it's not a curveball question. It's a regular question, but... I mean, like, what motivated you to start your own business at such a young age? How old were you? Like, I was, 14, uh, 12? I started at, like, 18. Hey, well, 17, 18, 18, okay. Yeah. <laughs> um, and what did you, like, like, what motivated you to start so early and so young and... Okay, well, here's the... I'll, I'll be very honest, right? Um, well, at that age, um, I was doing a lot of things, like a lot of partying and stuff with my friends and stuff like that, right? And a lot of, like, bad habits, I guess, whatever, right? So I, I realized very early on that I was working part-time and I couldn't even afford all the things that I wanted to do just to sort of get over the fact that I work part-time, you know? Mm. Like, it, it was this, like, weird cycle of uh, working part-time, being unhappy, drinking or whatever, and then working part-time again. And it was just this bad cycle where you know you're not going to get anywhere in life where you're happy and stable and you feel fulfilled at a job, right? Mm -hmm. Thank you so much for watching the vlog. I really appreciate it. I mean, if you've lasted this long, you like earned a medal or something. You deserve a medal. Um, and also, I hope that you got some sort of good information from Noman. I mean, he's a very like uh, inspiring young adult. He started his business when he was, like he said, in his mid 20th year of his life. But yeah. <laughs> Um, also, if you do, if you did like this video, please do drop a like. It really means a lot, and it actually really helps more than you know I can explain. And subscribing also helps a lot too. Uh, and lastly, these lights are so bad. I know it's yellow, it's ugly, but I will be changing them out to white lights so that you know at a time like this when it's nighttime, recording wouldn't be such a drag with ugly lights. But anyways, until next time. Take care, guys.